this tutorial, you will learn to interface the BMP280 sensor with Node MCU ESP8266 development board. Then monitor its parameters like temperature, parametric pressure, and altitude on 0.96 inch OLED display, and also on the Blink IoT platform. Here, the Node MCU ESP8266 reads the temperature, pressure, and altitude value from the BMP280 sensor and prints them on the 0.96 inch SST1306 OLED display, and which can be monitored over the Blink IoT cloud. The components required for this project are Node MCU ESP8266 development board, BMP280 barometric pressure sensor, 0.96 inch OLED display, few jumpers wire, and breadboard. Now let's interface the BMP280 sensor and OLED display with Node MCU ESP8266 module. The connections are fairly simple because the OLED display and BMP280 sensor both communicates with Node MCU with I2C mode. This means we can connect both modules with the same I2C pins on Node MCU. So connect the components as shown in the schematics below. Go through the schematics once more to ensure that everything is properly connected. Now let's configure the Blink app for BMP280 based IoT weather station. To set up the Blink IoT app for wireless weather station, you need to first download the app from the Play Store for Android users and for iOS users you can download it from App Store. Once the installation is complete, open the app and sign up for the application using your email address and password. Now click on the create new project and provide the name of your project as BMP280 IoT Weather Station or simply Weather Station. Choose the Node MCU Development Board and then connection type is Wi Fi. Then click on the Create button. The Blink authentication token will be sent to your email address and we will need it later on programming. Now click on the plus icon on the top right corner of your screen. Search for the gadget and add three of them to your main screen. Now click on the first gauge and name it as temperature. Set the input pin to the virtual pin B1 and enter the input range and choose the refresh rate as 1 second. Similarly do same for pressure and altitude. Finally, the Blink app setup for BMP280 based IoT weather station using Node MCU ESP8266 is completed. Now let's go to the programming part. So to program the ESP8266 OLED display and BMP280 sensor with Arduino IDE, we need a few libraries. The Adapt BMP280 contains the function that makes our work easier to write the code. It will grab the parameters from the sensor while we use Adaptive GFX and SST1306 libraries to easily display the text and graphics on the OLED display. The ESP8266 Wi Fi and Blink library helps to connect to the local network and send the data to the Blink IoT cloud. You need to change the Wi Fi credentials and Blink authentication token that you have received on the email address through this code. Here we have defined the width, height, and reset pin for OLED display, and we also initialize the adapter display library. Here we have defined I2C communication protocol with BMP280 sensor, and in the setup part, First we have started the serial communication and started the Blink IoT cloud account authentication process and thirdly we have initialized the OLED display and on the OLED screen through this code we will print the weather station vertically and using this code we have initialized the BMP280 barometric pressure sensor and if anything goes wrong it displays the error message on the OLED display. 
this code simply displays the temperature pressure and altitude on the oled display using display.print function and in the loop section we have initiated blink library and using this float variable we will read the temperature humidity and pressure from the bmp280 sensor and store it in the temp press and alt variables the following code prints the data on the 0.96 inch oled display we have used here blink dot virtual write function to send the temperature, pressure, and altitude values to the blink IoT app through the virtual pins B1, B2, and B3 respectively. I have provided the complete code for BMP280 based IoT weather station. You can simply copy the code to your Arduino IDE and upload it to your Node MCU development board. When the code is uploaded, ESP8266 will connect to the Blink server. It initializes the sensor and prints the parameters in OLED display. Now you can check the Blink app on your mobile phone. The mobile phone receives the BMP280 weather station data wirelessly. Now if you have followed all the mentioned steps and connected everything accordingly then you should see the weather station data on your OLED display and the blink application with no any errors. So that's all for today's video and this is another BMP280 based IoT weather station which will monitor the temperature, atmospheric pressure and altitude data on blink IoT application. I hope you love this project, if you did please share it with others and don't forget to subscribe to this channel.